What's the matter? You don't think you deserve to be saved. Don't normally see you off leash. Where's your boss? Castillo? Well, he's, uh, he's not here. You see, he has this weakness. He likes you. I tell you something, if you promise not to tell another soul. Okay. I'm not a uh, hammer, as you say. I have questions. I, I have doubts. You did the best you could. I forgive you. Dean, we know this is difficult to understand. And we... don't care. My superiors have begun to question my sympathies. Your sympathies? I was getting too close to the humans in my charge. You. They feel I've begun to express emotions, doorways to doubt. This can impair my judgment for what it's worth. I would give anything not to have you do this. What do you want from me, Castiel? I'm considering disobedience. Good. No, it isn't. For the first time, I feel... It gets worse. I learned my lesson while I was away, Dean. I serve heaven, I don't serve man. And I certainly don't serve you. I see inside you. I see your guilt, your anger, confusion. Now you were gonna help me once, weren't you? You were gonna warn me about all this before they dragged you back to Bible camp. Help me, now. Please. What would you have me do? Get me to Sam. We can stop this before it's too late. I do that. We will all be hunted. We'll all be killed. If there was anything worth dying for, this is it. But you guys aren't supposed to be there. You're not in this story. Yeah, well, we're making it up as we go. I killed two angels this week. So my brothers, I'm hunted, I rebelled, and I did it all of it for you. God. Don't do that. Hello, Dean. Cares. We've talked about this. Personal space. My apologies. So what, I'm Thelma and you're Louise and we're just gonna hold hands and sail off this cliff together? I need your help. Because you are the only one who'll help me. Please. We're humans. And when humans want something really, really bad, we lie. Why? Because that's how you become president. Dude, come on, anything? Hmm? Booze, women? Yeah, I've been with a woman before, right? Or an angel, at least. You mean to tell me you've never been up there doing a little cloud seating? Look, I've never had occasion, okay? All right. Let me tell you something. There are two things that I know for certain. One, Bert and Ernie are gay. Two, you are not gonna die a virgin. Out on my watch. Let's go. 
Showtime. Hi. What's your name? Cass. His name is Cass. What's your name? Chastity. Chastity. <laughs> wow. Is that Kismet or what, buddy? Huh? Well, he likes you, and you like him, so. Dayenu. Come on, baby. We should go. Come on. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> oh, nothing. Whew. It's been a long time since I've left that door. <laughs> oh, it's been more than a long time. Years. Hey, Chuck, is Cass still here? Yeah. I don't think Cass is going anywhere. Uh, excuse me, ladies. I think I need to confer with our fearless leader for a minute. Why not go get washed up for the orgy? That's good. Classy. <laughs> what? I like past you. It's pretty nice timing, Cass. We had an appointment. Don't ever change. Yeah, room 31C, basement level, St. James Medical Center. I'm there now. Yeah, I get that. I'm gonna hang up now. Right. Oh, Cass, not for nothing, but the last person who looked at me like that, I got laid. Uh, why don't you uh, go keep an eye on Adam? I gave everything for you. And this is what you give to me. I spent all that time trying to get through to you. Dean calls once and now it's... Hello. Yes. So, what, you, you like him better or something? Dean and I do share a more profound bond. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, you have me confused with the other angel? You know, the one in the dirty trench coat who's in love with you? Why well, it always gotta be me that makes the call, huh? It's not like Cash lives in my ass. The dude's busy. Cash, get out of my ass. I was never in your... My friend is very sick. I have a uh, painful burning sensation. Oh, well, he's out. Sorry. Uh, you happen to know where he is? If he hasn't called in. You might want to find yourself some ointment. See? The stench of that impala's all over your overcoat, Angel. And the worst part was Dean. Trying so hard to be loyal, with every instinct telling him otherwise. So I went to an old friend for help. But watching him, I stopped. Everything he sacrificed. And I was about to ask him for more. I did it to protect you. I did it to protect all of you. I can't turn back now. I can't. It's not too late. Damn it, Cass, we can fix this! Dean, it's not broken. Run! You have to run now! Run! I thought you said that we were like family. Well, I think that too. Shouldn't trust run both ways. Cass, I just can't. Dean, I do everything that you ask. I always come when you call, and I am your friend. Still, despite your lack of faith in me and now your threats, I just saved you yet again. Has anyone but your closest kin ever done more for you? Someone has to speak for God. And who says you speak for God? You're wrong. I am utterly indifferent to sexual orientation. I really overreached. You think? I'm gonna find some way to redeem myself to you. 
All right, well, one thing at a time. Come on, let's get you out of here. Come on. I mean it, Dean. Why? Go ask him. He was your boyfriend first. We're all cursed. I seem like good luck to you. What? I don't want to make you uncomfortable. But I detect a note of forgiveness. <laughs> yeah, we're all probably going to die tomorrow, so... Well, I'll go with you. Too much heart was always Castiel's problem. Yes. <laughs> Damn, it's good to see you. Nice preach for us. Thank you. I prayed to you, Cass, every night. I know. You know, and you didn't... What the hell's wrong with you? I am an angel in a land of abominations. There have been things hunting me from the moment we arrived. Join the club! These are not just monsters, Dean. They're Leviathan. I have a price on my head, and I've been trying to stay one step ahead of them to... to keep them away from you. That's why I ran. Better? You heard me, didn't you? Who you pray to? He hasn't been right since he got back from purgatory. We still don't know how he got out of there. Yeah, I don't know, Dean. If he's so sketchy, then why were you praying to him? I won't hurt Dean. Yes, you will. You are. Chaos, fight this! This is not you! Fight it! <laughs> what have you done to me? Just relax, Castiel. Let your vessel do what you know deep down is the right thing. What have you done to me, Naomi? Who's Naomi? What have I done to you? Do you have any idea what it's like out there? There's blood everywhere. And it's on your hands after everything you did to us, to heaven. I fixed you, Castiel. I fixed you. I know you're in there. I know you can hear me. It's me. We're family. We need you. I need you. You have to choose, Castiel. Us or them. Good. What broke the connection? I don't know. Are you okay? Me? Yeah, I'm casting you up pretty good. And? And I just wanted to make sure you're okay. What, like my feelings? If that's what you want to talk about, sure. I know. You're hoping Castiel will return to you. I admire your loyalty. I only wish he felt the same way. What about, uh, Castiel? He seems helpful and dreamy. And where's the pie? I think we're out. You don't understand. I need pie. I'll be seeing you both. Thanks for the help. Problem. Damn, that's, that's sweet. sweet. How about the next one's on me?